Hey guys, what's up? I just wanted to do a little chatty video, and because it's so beautiful outside, I hope you can see a little bit of, like, the fall leaves in the background, or anything, you know? Ooh, I just got a text message. But I just wanted to talk about the reasons that I left Hawaii, because I'm sure in the future, if, you know, people ever go look back at my videos, they'll see that I lived in Hawaii and that I wanted to go to school there and all this stuff. So like, why on earth would I leave Hawaii, which is paradise, and come back to Iowa? And the answer is, my dog. <laughs> the answer just is, there's a lot. I was having a lot of anxiety when I was home for the summer to begin with. And I think throwing myself into a new city in Hawaii um, with knowing nobody because I had I made 20 like over 20 friends when I lived in Hawaii the first time because I was in an internship living with so many people at the time and I've created so many good friends that I still talk to today but they all moved back to the mainland so when I moved back to Hawaii um, a couple months ago it was just me and in this new town, basically working all the time with no car, so I couldn't really do anything. And I didn't know anybody, and except for my ex-boyfriend. And I don't know, I don't think it's very healthy to hang out with only your ex-boyfriend. And I don't know, no offense to you if you're watching this, but... <laughs> hey, Jake. So, basically, I just kind of got really sad. I missed home. I got really close with my family while I was home for the summer because they're some of the people I'm closest to. They're the people I go to when I need to talk to them about something and um, or talk to somebody about something. And also, before I moved, I like literally like a couple weeks before I moved, I went to Electric Forest, which is a festival, and I met a boy. <laughs> You go back and look, you can tell. I met a boy that I really liked and never thought anything would come of it, but he was just the sweetest boy ever and I just like fell in love with him and I couldn't stop talking to him so there was no way it was gonna work if I lived in Hawaii so I'm not saying I moved back for him but it definitely like didn't help that there's this amazing boy that I was pretty much dating when I left and then I couldn't see him ever. So, yeah, he'll actually be here next week. We're still dating. Um, it's been like four months. And, yeah, that's about it. Um, I love Hawaii. I wish I could have made it work. And this is why I wanted to make this video. Hopefully it will help some people. Shh! My oh my god. Sorry about my dogs, by the way. I hope that this video will help some people to know that if you're moving somewhere, it's not going to be easy, especially if you don't know anybody and it's a new environment. It's not going to be easy, but everyone goes through that when they move away to college and stuff like that. They get that anxiety and that feeling that it's just not going to work. And I honestly think if I would have just kept, like, um, held out for a little bit, I would have been, oh my god, I think I would have been completely fine. And that's the point I'm trying to make in this video. But that being said, I don't regret moving back. I get to be close to my boyfriend. I was feeling sad when I was on Big Island because there's not a lot of concerts there. And that's one of the things that brings me a lot of joy in life is seeing live music. And um, yeah, just there's not really a lot out there. Um, so I can travel more and I can go to concerts more when I was living out there. Anytime I wanted to travel or come back to the mainland for anything was at least a thousand dollar ticket and um, I know I said something about that in my everything you need to know about moving to Hawaii video but yeah, that was just my point. Um, a lot of people can make moving to Hawaii work if they just stick it out and make new friends and build a support system there but I've also met a lot of people in Hawaii who just couldn't make it work because everyone they know and love is back on the mainland over 3,000 miles away. Like, it's literally a different country out there, so it's like, you can't just come home for the weekend. 
So that's my reasons. Um, if you liked this video or these types of videos, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and I will be making more every week.